What's going on everyone? My name is Randall. I hope all y'all are having a fantastic day today. If you watched last week's video, you'd know in this one I'm doing a little room decor to help fill out a bunch of empty space in here. Quick update on the surgery. Uh, I don't have to wear my sling anymore indoors under controlled environments, which is huge. Some people ask me if I'm a righty and how I handle my alone time. And um, let's just say it's a pretty unpleasurable surprise. So I picked up these skateboards right here. I'm going to go outside and spray paint them a little bit and just throw them up on the wall. But yeah, as you can probably see, I have some stuff on my walls. But this wall right here just looks like got like a full body Brazilian wax. But with that said, let's hop right into the video. Okay, so outside, as you can see, uh, there's a lot of noise out here. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but I apologize in advance. So, materials wise, of course, you need your skateboards. Then, uh, spray paint, whatever you want. You get from like Home Depot, Lowe's. I use uh, Rust Um Just make sure you get the glossy type, because uh, they'll look better. And then you'll need things to make your planets. So for this one, I'm doing like a galaxy theme, uh, just to get different shapes and whatnot. Got these from Target earlier today, 69 cents, nice. Um, they're just cheap plastic things. Um, if they are light, just make sure you have like a rock or like a shoe or something you can put on top uh, to just hold it down. Uh, probably not a shoe. You'll also need sandpaper as well to scuff up the skateboard so the paint can stick. Um, I would get a bunch of different kinds um, just to make sure you can rough it up. Um, if you're into s and Maybe look into this. And last but not least, uh, paper bags or like the shiny, filmy paper and whatnot. Um, these, you may call paper bags. I like to call them the bedroom because this is where the magic happens. So, first step is to take your skateboard and sand them down. Um, I, I like to use uh, really gritty stuff at the beginning and then smooth it out a little bit at the end just so um, you get all that, you know. So, let's get this open. Okay, so after you go a couple times through with the sandpaper, um, you'll have like all this white powder on your hands, all over the board. So what you gotta do is collect all of it, put it in small baggies, and then sell them to your friends. And then now I'm gonna get a wet paper towel, just wipe it all down, just to get all that extra, you know, off. And then uh, I'll take this white glossy uh, spray paint, uh, put a couple layers on it, give it a nice base, and then I will go from there. So just did my first coat of white on the skateboard. Um, another thing I forgot to mention, uh, make sure you wear a mask, please. Um, there's a lot of chemicals in the spray paint and whatnot, and if you inhale too much of that, you'll probably become a Karen. So make sure you, you wear this mask. Um, as for the white, it doesn't need to be perfect. Um, it's just a nice base coat, just to make sure that uh, the colors pop they put on there. Because like I said, we're doing a galaxy. It's black, blue, purple, and all these colors I can't see because I'm colorblind. So, um, it'll, Go over the white, uh, you won't even see the white for the most part, um, but just make sure you put like one or two layers down. Uh, let it dry for the most part. Um, for the planets, and when I'm gonna be spray painting next, um, it's pretty time sensitive because you want uh, the spray paint when you put it on board to be a little bit moist, just so you can modify it a lot easier and you can mix the paints. Um, and one last thing I didn't say before, uh, as you saw in the video, I taped the skateboards together because I'm gonna be doing uh, a combination on both of them together with planets, so um, that way it won't doesn't slide and all that. So, five head move right there. Um, but yeah, uh, let's get right into it.
So I was debating whether to do anything more with this. Um, I had a couple things in mind, but it's just so damn hot. Like I think my balls are literally around my ankles right now. It is so freaking hot. And it's just drying up all the paint. Uh, and you can't do a lot of things that you want to do because it's so damn hot. Um, and I didn't want to do this indoors, so uh, there goes that. Also, uh, my fingers, when I was doing the stars, I was spraying painting them, uh, looks like I've been finger, finger banging the chick for three hours. Um, I do not recommend that. I recommend putting on gloves, um, but they're like $30 for one pair, and I'm not about that. Um, so to take a look at the final product right now, let me turn this baby around. So you got uh, three planets. Uh, you got like this light source thingy coming from over here. Um, of course, like on the bottom, there's the shadows and whatnot. Um, you see right here, it's like, eh, because, you know, um, the paint was just drying too much. These ones look okay. Maybe do the shadows a little bit too much, but yeah, that's a final product. Um, so now I'm going to clean up all of this crap, um, go inside, try to hang them on my walls, even though I only have one arm and I can only lift it this high. Uh, but I have a little step stool because I have a small roommate. So um, let's get to that. I spent like five, ten minutes cleaning my hands. She really left her mark, man. You know, some people like to leave their mark on their hands. Some people like to leave them on the neck to each their own, you know? Um, but here's the final product of the skateboards on my wall. Uh, I actually dropped this one out. I was trying to put it down. Went to grab with my right hand. Did not feel so well. Um, but hopefully they're up straight. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, I don't think it's crooked. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it for my room. Um, don't want to put any stuff over my bed because dust gets on and then it falls in my mouth when I go to sleep and then you get like corona or something like that. Um, but anyways, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, feel free to drop a like, subscribe if you want to see more content and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.